iOS 7 runs buttery smooth on the iPhone 5C and brings a major overhaul to the user interface. It has a brand new flat look, transparent menus and keyboard, new system icons and apps, and a new control center, and much more. The lock screen is of course the first thing you'll notice when you turn the phone on. It can be unlocked with a single swipe to the right from anywhere on the screen. If you swipe down from the top, you'll get to the notification center, while a swipe from the bottom brings up the new control center. There's a quick access to the camera as well. The home screen welcomes you with new animations and icons. There's no dedicated spotlight page in iOS 7. Instead, you can access it with an upward swipe. The folders on the home screen are now scrollable and can contain virtually unlimited apps. The parallax view effect is available on the lock screen and in the folders. There are seven dynamic wallpapers you can choose from, though they are identical except for a different color scheme. The notification area has been divided into three tabs. Today, which shows your daily tasks and reminders, all shows your other notifications, and missed shows only missed notifications like calls. The control center is invoked with a swipe up from the bottom of the screen. It has five toggles, airplane mode, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, do not disturb mode and rotation lock. Then there is the brightness slider, the music controls with volume and duration scrubbers, followed by airdrop quick access and four shortcuts, flashlight, clock, calculator, and camera. The airdrop setting is available system-wide and makes really easy file transfers between iOS and macOS devices. All system apps have refreshed interfaces, messages, calendars, reminders, music player, phone app, clock, notes, and email. Some of them also offer additional functionality. Photos now organizes the images better. The compass has levels. The app store offers location-based suggestions. Weather now has animations. And the camera can take square photos and comes with filters with live preview. The settings menu is the same, it just has a new skin. Siri, officially out of beta in iOS 7 and with new looks, has extra functionality, including type to search and different voice options. The notification and control center, as well as the home screen folders, change their semi-transparent background depending on the app or home screen background. With every newly activated iPhone 5C, you also get the complete iWorks suite package, including Pages, Numbers, Keynote, plus the iMovie and iPhoto apps for editing and managing videos and pictures. The iPhone 5C doesn't have new features beyond those coming with iOS 7, so the user experience is mostly similar to an updated iPhone 5. To get the real novelties by Apple, you'd have to go for the iPhone 5S flagship.